Today, we will be going through the procedure for how to set a J-style motor coupling. If you have any questions about this procedure or are uncertain about any detail, seek clarification and do not proceed. For written information, reference the U45100 NEMA IEC servo input adapters and their couplings user manual, available online at nord.com. For this procedure, you would need a calculator, pen and paper, an Allen key, caliper, straight edge, and red Loctite number 243. Before beginning, confirm that no power is being applied to the motor. In order to establish the proper location of the coupling, we need to first measure some dimensions. We will plug those dimensions into the formula shown here. Measure the distance from the face of the input adapter to the face of the spline shaft. Use a ruler or a similar tool as a flat edge surface. Record that measurement as A in the equation below. Measure the depth of the coupling engagement zone. Record the measurement as B in the equation below. Add A plus B and subtract 0 0.08 inches, approximately 2 millimeters, from the distance. This needs to be done so that the coupling will not be preloaded after installation. Use the resulting measurement to locate the coupling from the face of the motor onto the rotor shaft. Once in place, tighten the set screw to lock the coupling in place. It is recommended that the key is staked or bonded in place to prohibit the key from vibrating out. Follow the instructions to mount the motor on the input adapter with the customer supply bolts.